Hi everybody and welcome to the Dive Brief. Today we're looking at a new brand to Simply Scuba. Now you've probably heard of them, they're called Beauchat. They've been around for a fair while now. Um, they're a French brand that makes everything from regulators and BCDs to wetsuits, masks, fins and snorkels and even like carrier bags for traveling and everything. And uh, yeah, I just thought I'd introduce them. So let's, let's take a close look at Beauchat. Now, Beauchat started in the south of France in Marseille back in the 1930s. So yeah, they've been around for a fair while and they know what they're doing. Um, Georges Beauchat was a very keen spear fisherman, as were so many in those days around the Mediterranean. So many of our large diving brands started out around in the Med uh, by just guys and girls that loved the ocean and just started to make their own gear because no one else was making what they needed. So they just took it upon themselves to make their own equipment. Beauchat himself was a descendant of a watchmaking family, so tinkering was kind of in his blood, and one of his first inventions was the Tarzan spear gun, which was actually the first elastic underwater spear gun. Beauchat was always working on creating better exposure protection to stay in the water for longer and to explore the underwater world in colder waters in different seasons. And whilst modern wetsuits like the Beauchat Fossier here, uh, they're made from cutting edge flexible neoprene, they've got sort of features that are all, all sorts of fantastic stuff for modern scuba divers. The, the overall idea hasn't really changed that much from Beauchat's original ideas. And some of Beauchat's original wetsuits, you can actually see um, Jacques Cousteau wearing them. Now, we don't really have the, the corset strings in our wetsuits anymore, but um, yeah, you can definitely see the inspirations. Moving into the 1950s, snorkeling and scuba diving were really starting to become more and more popular, and the classic oval mask was all the range, but it was actually Beauchat that introduced an angled window so that you can look downwards more easily, and actual finger wells so that you could pinch your nose with your fingers to equalize your ears. Features that you find on almost every single diving mask today, uh, a lot like the Max Lux diving masks. Lenses that are angled slightly downwards and they have a large big open window to let plenty of light in. Jet fins were actually created by Beauchat in 1964 and the name and design was later sold to Scuba Pro in the 1970s. If you look at modern fins like the Apex RK3s, it hasn't really changed that much. The main difference is in that fin strap. But if you look at modern Beauchat fins like the Aquabionic, they feature a lot of brand new cutting edge concepts like double hinges and dual materials that allow the blade to change shape and angles during each part of the fin kick cycle. Beauchat have always been there at the cutting edge of scuba and apnea. I mean, my first mask ever were, that was originally my father's was a Beauchat mask. Um, I can't remember the name of it because it was so long ago, but that introduced me to the underwater world. There's all sorts of Beauchat gear on simplyscuba.com. Just head over. I'll put a bunch of links down in the description below so you can check out some some of the cool Beauchat gear on Simply Scuba, and there's even more to come throughout the, uh, the coming seasons, 2022, and let us know what you think of Beauchat dive gear down in the comments below. Thank you for watching everybody, and of course, safe diving.